Good morning, Frankfurt. Welcome to HTTV Morning Announcements. Please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the Republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, for liberty and justice for all. Hope you all found your way to the school all right through all that fog. I'm Ruri and this is Lichard. For lunch today in lines one and two, Asian or buffalo bites with mini corn dogs. In line three, I have a hot dog bar. Line four will be closed and line five will have flatbed pizzas. Yeah. For birthdays today, we'll have Shelby Abbott, Bernice Garcia Hernandez, and Alexis Weed. Now weather with Haley. It is 29 degrees outside today. There is 0% chance of precipitation. But look for rain and higher temperatures in the next few days. Now back to the studio. Distinguished Young Women is a program that combines the chance to win a college scholarship with a program that offers life skills training to prepare young women for the world after high school. Nina Harshman and Katie Stitzworth were the finals for the Clinton County Distinguished Young Women that took place on December 22, 2017. Nina Harshman was selected as the 2018 Distinguished Young Women of Clinton County. N Nina is preparing with 23 other women during the week of February 11th in Kokomo for the state level of Distinguished Young Women. These participants will be involved in workshops to work on interview skills, public speaking, self-confidence, and community service projects. Congratulations to both of these young women for representing Clinton County Senior Ladies. There will be another FAFSA night at the Purdue Extension Office on Thursday, February 8th from 4 to 6.30 p.m. Any questions, feel free to contact Purdue Extension. Applications are now open for both Hoosier Girls and Hoosier Boys State. If you have any interest in leadership, government, or politics and are a junior girl or boy with good academic standing, apply in student services by January 17th to attend Hoosier Boys or Girls or Boys State this summer. Make sure to wear your blue t-shirt to the boys basketball game versus Rostov. Mr. Seymour's class needs to report to 0303 to Eric Payton, Tuesday, January 9th. We will have a student council meeting this Wednesday during community in Mrs. Hale's room. We have a lot to discuss, so please be prompt. This is for all student council members, not just officers. Friday, January 12th is the last day to be able to purchase laptop insurance for, the school, for this school year. Insurance is $25 and can be made at the FHS uh, bookstore. Cash, check, or credit cards accepted. Don't miss out. Parent-teacher conference. Pick up a report card and talk with teachers. Teachers will be in their classrooms to meet with parents. Work on cardio, muscular endurance with an aerobic fitness class. This class helps students work towards a healthy body and overall wellness. The class will be replacing the lifetime fitness class. Big broadcast auditions will be Monday and Tuesday, January 15th and 16th at 3 o'clock in the theater. All, perform all performances must be no longer than three minutes and show ready. In order to be in the show, you must audition. There will be no submissions accepted after January 16th. Anyone interested in being a part of walk-ons, there will be a call-out this Tuesday after school in the theater. Come with skits ideas. And are interested in working crew for big broadcasts, there will be a call-out this Wednesday during community. If you have any questions, please see Mr. Taylor. Congratulations to the Hot Dog Band on the wonderful performance at Disney World's Magic Kingdom on December 30th. Decca After Dark hours will be today from 2.45 to 4 p.m. Clinton County Youth Theater, or CCYT, present The Adventures of Stuart Little. Tickets are $6 each. Showtimes are Thursday and February, Friday, sorry, January 11th and 12th at 7 p.m. and Saturday, January 13th at 2 p.m. and 7 p.m. And I'll send you to sports. There are no scores to report on today, but if you would like to order a shirt celebrating Noemi's accomplishment of gaining the girls wrestling state, then make sure to give Coach Elite your name and shirt size by the end of the day today. The shirts will be selling for $10 a piece. Also, the track and field call-out is Thursday after school. Please meet at the stairs at 3 o'clock. If you're a winter sport athlete, you do not need to attend. Please just contact Coach Elite with any interest. If you cannot make the meeting, please let Coach Elite know before Thursday. 
That's it for sports. Now back to the studio. Uh, another day of waking up late in hopes for a two-hour delay. That's never going to come. Thanks for watching Daily Announcements. We'll see you tomorrow.